Hi, this is Christina Hills, and this video is about using breadcrumbs on your site, but using it with the Yoast SEO plugin. So if you want to know what breadcrumbs are, here's an example. It will show where you are on the site. So Pamela Pollock is a child page of websites for coaches, which is a child page of WordPress examples. So these are breadcrumbs and breadcrumbs help the user find where they are and to be able to click up to the parent pages. So if you're using Yoast SEO, Yoast SEO has it built in. So you just come to SEO search appearance and up at the top you click on breadcrumbs it's probably enabled, but in case it's disabled, you can just click Enabled. And then I like to bold the last page, meaning this is the page we're on. So I have that bolded. But out of the box, you really don't need to do anything. And you can change the separator. What the separator is, is the character that's in between. And I have this little arrow, and I got this little arrow from this arrows symbols. I just searched for it and I got this little code here. Um, so I'll include this link uh, under the video so that you can find what kind of separators you want or you can just use the default. So there's a default in here if you don't want to worry about that. And then you just need to hit save changes. Now here's the part that I found confusing and that's why I'm making this video. I didn't know how to add it, so I did a Google search on how to insert Yoast SEO breadcrumbs, and I saw this warning. This guide is for advanced users, and here's this code, and I didn't want to add code to my theme. But later I discovered if you scroll down, there is a short code. See, alternatively, you can manually add the breadcrumb short code. So I love short codes because it makes it super easy. So all you have to do is copy this short code and then edit the page and just add this short code in. So once you do that and you click on update, then you will have Yoast SEO breadcrumbs. So to recap, in order to get, and there's lots of other breadcrumbs uh, plugins, but if you're already using Yoast SEO for your SEO and you want to add this in, you can add the short code on the specific pages you want. So for example, if I go to Website for Coaches and I click on Ellen Wanamaker, I have not added that short code in yet. So short codes are great. You put them where you want them and then then you have them or not. So there's just a lot of flexibility when using uh, short codes. So I wanted to make this video to make it easy for you to add breadcrumbs on your site uh, wherever you want to put them with that short code with Yoast SEO. This is Christina Hills.